So good health is really a golden key to so much in our lives. Can you relate to this too? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Well, today we will dive into one of nature's wonders to help us keeping good health and restoring it. I am uh, Trude Divendal, and I'm pretty interested in good health. As a former world champion, three-time Olympic medalist, also being a mom, a friend, and a business owner, I, uh, I know how important health is. I really appreciate it. And um, it's for the general well-being, for personal power and performances. And so to have the energy also, you know, to stand in the storm when life throws something challenging at us. Sometimes happens. Yeah. Good health is so key. So, well, these are some of the reasons I am so happy to have this opportunity to talk with Eddie Stone, the founder of Touchstone Essentials, which is a 10-year-old family-owned and run company. I love this company, not only because of the amazing products I've come to learn and love, but also because of the warm-hearted people that are involved in that company. So, Eddie Stone, he has been working with Zeolite for over 30 years. So I definitely consider him an expert. And so it's an honor, Eddie, to, to welcome you. A warm welcome. Hi. Hi, Trudy. So, so much uh, of a pleasure to be able to work with you today and uh, talk about these important uh, subject matters and to speak to your audience. So thank you. This is an honor. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, yes, I'm so excited to have this talk about this amazing nature product, the Zeolite. And uh, actually, I dived into it um, in 2010 is the first time I, it crossed my path. Then it was like a powder. And um, I don't know if it really helped me and I stopped using it. And then in 2020, I discovered the Touchstone Essential Zeolite again, and I was on it. And it's fluid and it's so much great things to say about this. So that is what our talk is going to be about. So Eddie, 30 years of experience with the Zeolite. How, how did it cross your path? You know, it's there's really two reasons um, that I had an interest in Zeolite. One, one was just general health. Uh, I'm 58 years old, married, have a have a couple of kids. And, you know, as you go through life experiences, right, you kind of see all these different aspects of life. But the one thing over time that I've really realized is that our health is something that we often take for granted. Mm -hmm. And for maybe as an athlete, you had an advantage over most of us, right? Because you had to think about your health for your performances. But, you know, for someone like myself, um, in my early 20s, I really wasn't paying attention to what I was eating, uh, exercise, quality sleep, all these kinds of things. And I found that I was at risk of developing high blood pressure, diabetes. I was gaining weight in ways that I shouldn't. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, my own mom, uh, Judy, uh, she was struggling with some health issues that were a little bit mysterious. We we didn't really understand why she was sort of constantly sick, losing weight, mm -hmm. real low energy. And so, you know, you can visit a lot of physicians and I'm thankful for physicians and the advice they can give you. But at the end of the day, you have to take charge of your own health if you really want to get the most out of life. And I'm I'm a big believer in not just living as long as we can i want to do that but i want to get the most out of life as i as i age and as i live vitality right energy yes. and in my mom's case i was watching what i felt like was perhaps a destiny for me if i didn't start paying attention and then we learned that for her the real health problem she was having was because she had had breast implants when she was younger mm -hmm. and her body had developed an autoimmune uh, response to them over time, plus one was actually leaking. And so she was becoming toxic, you know, kind of from the inside out. And 
you know, I have to say, I, I didn't think a lot about toxins. I certainly recognized man-made chemicals can damage our cells and our DNA, but I didn't think too much about it. When you're, when you're in your twenties, I don't think many people think too much about this, but we were able to get her some help and have some chelation therapy and help to lower the amount of burden these toxins were placing on her body and her health really improved. And it really sent me down a path of researching and learning the fact that it's not just your lifestyle. Lifestyle is important, right? Managing stress and exercise and, and, and these things are important. Uh, nutrition, micronutrients, they're important. But now in a modern world, we have to manage toxins too. Yes. Yeah, there are a hundred plus thousand man-made toxins that are in consumer products that we use every day. Could be um, nonstick cookware. It could be dry cleaning fluids used on your clothing. It could be the sheets or the bedspread or the carpet that's placed into your home or the paint that's used in your home. I mean, it's just, it's just everywhere. And I don't, know that the human body was fully designed to manage all this exposure. And so we, we run risk of increasing our chances of developing heart disease or cancer or diabetes or even obesity because toxins can impact your metabolism in a negative way. And so it sent me down a path of trying to learn what I could do as a person uh, to help manage toxins. And one of the things I realized was that natural zeolite is one of those tools. And so that started my uh, interest in, in learning more about zeolites. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Well, isn't it interesting how, you know, the hardships in life puts us on, puts us on the path and makes us study, dive into things, and it really becomes um, the path many in many times. Uh, it, uh it does. I mean, that's, it's an amazing how life will point you in a certain direction and you may not think you want to go, but it's important to travel. Yeah. And, you know, I think probably because of my background as a top athlete, I, I mentioned it's, I so value good health. And, um, and as you said, we are living in this world that is in the, I'm 56 years old now, and in a way, one can think people at my age, and so maybe what we we could be a bit like those when we were 20. We're 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 going happy and think everything is okay. Uh, we're doing the 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 normal things we think is okay to take care of our health, as you mentioned, with nutrition, training a little bit, and yeah, you know, not too much alcohol and and pretty good life. M many people live that way, I feel, and also in Norway and. But still, we, we really don't realize how toxic our world have become. Even for people as me, I try to eat ecological food. Um, but I mean, what's coming from the sky, through the rain, and all our products, as you said. And I actually read an article saying that uh, in Norway, Norwegians have, have is, is one of the nations with the most big mixtures of toxicity in our yeah. bodies. Yeah. You know, yeah. when I, when I think about what you're saying, you know, what I realize is that it, it toxins aren't always obvious. You know, there's thousands and thousands of toxins we're exposed to, but you can't necessarily see them or smell them. Mm. It's like the dirty little secret of modern living. We, we need all these chemicals for our phones and for fuel or whatever it happens to be. Um, but yet we don't think about the consequences of you breathing it every day or in the water or in the food supply or whatever it is. So it's this, it's this dirty little secret that de degrades our health year by year by year. We're more likely to get asthma. We're more likely to have problems with inflammatory issues. We're more likely to get arthritis. I mean, all these things are made worse because of toxins. Mm -hmm. And this is, um, I just want to mention also for the audience here that um, Eddie has been so nice to put together a really nice offer for you. So stay with us because as we dive into what's really going on and how you can have the help on an easy day-to-day -day basis, we're getting there. Uh, and, and a couple of questions, as you said, um, so 
What is zeolite, actually? Yeah. So zeolites have a very long history. They're a natural mineral. Now, there are synthetic zeolites, and I would kind of caution people mm -hmm. about the consumption of industrial um, zeolites. They're not made for human beings, although they're sometimes sold as dietary supplements, right, which, which worries me. But they're, they're natural minerals that form when uh, lava or lava ash collides with playa lakes or salt water, uh, these these crystal crystals form, and and they've been we, they've been around for forever, so to speak, and they're all over the world. There's a specific type of zeolite called clinoptilolite. It's a sheet like zeolite, and that's the one we work with, and we work with that because it's the one globally that all the research has been done on for both human consumption, as well as using it with your animals uh, for their health as well. And in fact, in the States, it has grass status, which means it's designated as safe by our FDA. And there are many countries in Asia, that's true, that have a similar type of recognition. Canada, uh, also uh, in many parts of Europe, it has that safety designation. And I just mentioned that because I want people to sort of understand how much we know about zeolites. Mm -hmm. the, the mineral has very interesting properties. If you looked at it under a microscope, because you can't see it in our product with your naked eye, it's too small, but under a really highly magnified um, microscope, you can see that it has a cage-like structure. It's like a diamond with cages inside. Mm -hmm. And because of its formation and it's a molecular structure, those cages have a negative charge. And what makes the zeolite so special is the heavy metals, things like cadmium, lead, mercury, hexavalent chromium, all these things that are sort of modern challenges to our health, generally speaking, have a positive charge. And so the zeolite has a natural interest in binding, almost like the north end and the south end of a magnet. Yeah. And since it's not an essential mineral, if you're using a zeolite supplement and it binds with these heavy metals, it processes out of your body in about a four to six hour period of time. So it's a very eloquent, mm -hmm. easy way for a person just day in and day out to do a little detoxification without all the side effects or having to fast or sort of some of these other challenges that can come with cleanses or detox programs. And so for me, when I first saw it, I really looked at the convenience of it yes. and the quality of the science. And I, I really felt like it would be a very important supplement to, uh, to provide for people. Yeah. And that's one of the things I really love about it because I've been into during the years, I've been into several diets, you know, researching with my own body. When do I feel more energized? Uh, what helps for my aller uh, allergy? That is really not much here anymore. And um, what, what is so beautiful about this is that how easy it is. Instead of, you know, making all this, there's a couple of things. Like if you have something with the liver, you want to do a liver detox and things like the, the, normal, not the normal way. As I understand it, the liver will like push out all the, the toxins and, uh, what, uh, and the heavy metals. And there it goes around in the bloodstream, creating chaos or you don't feel too well and so and here you have this beautiful touchstone zeolite that runs around mm. in my body i see it like a doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah. <laughs> it walks around it yeah and if i understand right it's like that's what i like too it's like the touchstone zeolite has this power so i mean when it had grabbed a lot of dirt uh, toxins uh with it it carries it instead of like, oh, I'm losing half of it until I'm out of the body. <laughs> right, right. That's right. So when something binds with it, it's called a preferred ion exchange. And so the zeolite has this affinity and it won't let go. So it basically, <laughs> unlike say an herb that might tease out a toxin and now it's available in your bloodstream, in the case of the zeolite, once it binds, it won't unbind. You might think of it like how an antioxidant works. Once it gives over its electron to a free radical to neutralize it, it that, that chemistry is done. The zeolite's the same way. So when you use the zeolite, it works. It's, it's, 
even though you can't see it, there's a physical property to it, right? It's a hardened mineral. It's floating through your body, through your blood, gets into your cells because it's nano-sized by purpose. It's designed to get into the cell. When it binds with these toxins, it just can't stay in your system. So four to six hours later, you know, it's evacuated generally through urine and it's taking those toxins with you. So utilizing it on a regular basis, it's a way to just control how much of a burden your body faces. And in the case of your liver, your liver and your kidneys do support. Your body's got natural pathways to detoxify. The challenge is in a modern world, all the modern chemicals can be very burdensome for both the kidney and livers. And the kidney and liver are really mostly focused on detoxification of biological materials, not necessarily man-made. And so the system can easily be overwhelmed by exposures. And that's why we just think whether it's adding deep green leafy cruciferous vegetables to your diet, which aids your body's detoxification. At the same time, you like to add good clean water. So does zeolite function in a very similar way to just support the ongoing detoxification efforts of your body. And that's really what we want to do with lifestyle decisions, avoiding toxins and thinking about how you live, thinking about your body's natural systems and supporting them. We just want to add the zeolite to our protocol so we can further aid how the body manages the toxins. Mm. And that is so simple and easy, easy to use. I just want to uh, um, underline that the way that the zeolite, you, your body, you can't absorb it. So it's just traveling through your body. So it won't Correct. interfere with any other things. Uh, um, no contraindications and, is mm. the proper proper way to say it. So there's there's no identified contraindications regarding food, medicine, or lifestyle. Mm. And that is so great. And it basically leaves your body with the urine, as you said. So yes, that's right. Off it goes. Yeah. Uh, Pretty simple process. Yes, yes. And so um, let me just dive into my questions there. I have, um, um, yeah, how does it influence the environment once it have left the body? Well, because of the structure and the size of the zeolite, and assuming in most cases, it's going out in human waste that's being managed through either ground-based systems or city-based systems, it isn't going to create a concentration mm -hmm. of toxins. However, people should know industrial-based zeolites have been used to control large environmental challenges, such as Chernobyl mixed with concrete, uh, was spread across a lot of those radioactive uh, sites. Fukushima, most recently in Japan, it's even been used in large scales uh, for managing industrial uh, waste around uh, commercial enterprises. So the zeolite's got a wide range of applications, but the very specifically the one for human beings is clinoptilolite, the one that we use, it's naturally mined, not synthetic. Of course, we size it specifically. We have a proprietary process. We prep the cage with calcium and magnesium to improve its performance. And so it's it needs to be managed properly, but it really can be a great tool. Yeah, but that tells something about the capacity for it. As you say, it's cleaning all that, the, the bigger environment too. Yeah, and that's, yeah absolutely. That's interesting to, to, to know as well. So, um, are, would you say all the fluid zeolites, are they the same? No, they're not the same. So when, when someone goes to buy zeolites, I'll, I'll give you some things to think about. Mm -hmm. Number one, you want to look for a naturally mined source of clinoptilolite. Uh, I'm sure there are a few other companies that work with them like we do. Uh, and I would tell people to avoid synthetics lab made or man made do not have the same structure they don't necessarily have the same endurance in the body and they're vulnerable to break down by what are called weak acids which are not unlike what you have in your gut and your in your bowel so number 1 you want to think about the source number 2 you want to think about the size 
It's very specific that we have a proprietary process using sound wave technology to reduce the size to that of a nanometer, the, a nano range, right? It's a nano range product. And that's because when we think about cadmium, lead, mercury, generally those particulates are angstrom in size and they're hiding out in the cells of the body. And so if you want to maximize your effectiveness, you want to have a zeolite particle that's small enough to move intracellularly. So we actually take ours and we trap it inside of highly cleaned water. And so anywhere that water goes in your body, including the cell, the zeolite will go as well. So it has an opportunity at the cellular level to bind with these heavy metals and other pollutants so giving you a chance to detox at cellular level. And that's really why I think, you know, over the last 10 years, we've just seen so many great stories. I think there's probably 20,000 positive five-star reviews. There's a million plus people, 60 some countries involved with the product. And so it's it's been great to see that if you help the body, it's so brilliant uh, how much good health can return to someone. And so the source the size and the proprietary process that we prep it with is really what makes this a special supplement. And that kind of gives me the chill, you know, when you tell it goes actually into the cells because we know that the environment inside the cells are so important and our body is cells, it's cells. So, yeah. so that, that's truly amazing. Um, and Another thing, I just, this is really important, I think, in these times. There are many people, we have had a couple of special years um, uh, where our immune system, our health uh, has maybe come under the microscope, so to speak. Uh, people are more and more aware of that health is really important and people have been more afraid of their health and people around them have become sick and so. and. Uh, how does the use of zeolite actually support our immune systems? Well, I think that's a, that's a great question. And I will say, along with all the tragedy of the last few years, mm -hmm. one of the things that's been positive, and we see this as a company, is how many people are talking about prevention, yeah, you know, paying more attention to diet and these other lifestyle issues, some adding some supplements. And so I'm, I really see amongst my friends and family, this heightened awareness about how important their health is. I, I tell people all the time, you only have one life and one body, you know, you don't get a second chance in terms of this body. So, you know, do, do the best that you can, but the way that the zeolite would impact your immune system is this. When your body is burdened by toxins, you know, maybe you're someone in Greece and you, you've lived near those wildfires there, mm -hmm. or someone in California in the United States, and there's just sort of no way to get away from the smoke and the particulates and things you're breathing because they're just there and they're now in the soil and you're gonna be in the crops, or maybe you're in China or some of these other large industrial cities. I don't know in Norway if you ever have any trouble with pollutants, but people that live in these cities and face these pollutants, right, this constant, constant battle. Well, all those pollutants, all those toxins weigh down their immune system. Your, your immune system, your central nervous system, your digestive system, none of these things can work as effectively if they're constantly having to manage toxins. And so anytime you can reduce the toxic burden and support how the body manages toxins, now there's space and there's cellular energy to manage your immune system. And so you can think about that getting out of the way, the clutter, almost like an automobile that you haven't taken care of. If all of a sudden you change the filter and the oil and you tune it up, every part of the car works better. Same thing with your body. The minute you make some decisions to improve these lifestyle factors, help the body manage toxicity, you're going to have more energy. Your immune system is going to be better. And here's a hidden little value, Trudy. Yeah. You're going to be in a better mood because yeah. most people don't think about the fact that the majority of your serotonin is made in your gut. And if your immune system's not working properly, your gut's not working properly, and you're not able to make something like serotonin, which is so critical 
to sort of energy and mood like you should. And so there's just a cascade of benefits that come by just supporting how your body manages toxins. Yeah. That is so amazing. Yeah. Yeah. And it's, I really like that. You know, sometimes during crisis, that's when we grow, that's when we discover new things. And if there's anything about these last years, there is how important health is. And this, this, our body is our temple. It's actually, yeah. it's our, how we transport during this physical life. And so the way I use zeolite is, um, uh, um, I did feel a change when I, I used it. Uh, when I started using it, but I wasn't really in a bad place when I started. I just felt it, that this is something really good for my health. And I want to have good health up into the 80s and 90s. And actually, I, I'm planning turning 100 and something with good health. Because I yeah. think it's great living here. And, and of course, if the health disappears when you're like 50, 60, it's a long run. But and I know that probably comes from my sport career as well. It's, it's something to be prepared. And it's something that you do on a daily basis is actually what brings you somewhere. And, and so I've just added this um, to my daily routine, actually, because, well, here in Norway, it's not too much. Um, you could say it's not too much pollution. You know, we're a little, we're a small country of 5 million people, but um, and a lot of nature. Uh, but as I said, we have uh, um, research have showed that Norwegians have actually uh, more toxins within their body in average than any other nation. And I think that's a part of because we live, um, we have been able to buy a lot of stuff. We have a good way of living. And so there's, there's a lot of chemicals. There's a lot of things passing yeah. by us actually. And it's, it's, it's not to scare anyone, but to be, you know, I just, with passion and 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 uh, caring for my fellow humans, uh, my clients, my family, uh, my friends, it's lo- like, please become aware of this because you can do it an easy way of. Uh, so what I do, um, you know, it's like every morning, and before I go to bed, I I do this zeolite. Just let us show it, huh? It's here. And so it's, it's really easy. Um, five drops of this one into a little bit of water. Yep. And then four, <laughs> like this on the thumb. And it's done. That's it. Simple. Simple. And, and this lasts for, you said, like four to six hours. So that means that sometimes during the day, I will do this again. And then before I go to bed. And with like this, and sometimes it's only two times. That's okay, but generally, and I I did it um, three times a day for more than a year actually. Like I'm in this detox, and then generally I went over to two times a day, morning, evening, easy, uh, just to keep on being in this uh, because we live in this toxic world. And yeah. uh, I just again I want to keep my health uh, during these years, and that's why I'm this. These are really my ghost go to some of my my go tos. Yeah, you know you 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 say that about Norway, and you know I've been fortunate to travel and see a lot of places that are like Norway, right? It's pristine. It doesn't have the same commercial obvious pollutants that you see. But the truth is, with the air and the water, you know toxins don't recognize borders. No. And so, you know, there, there may be pollutants happening in the north of the U.S., but in the south where I live, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to deal with them. Or if you're in California and there's pollutants or Fukushima years ago in Japan, via the jet stream, both the U- western U.S. and Canada, they're going to experience those same toxins. And so we, we unfortunately can't just rely on the pretty environment we live in. The reality is we have to be aware no matter where we live. Exactly, exactly. Um, one question before we, we, we move to the end here. Uh, a lot of people are on different kinds of drugs, medicine. Uh, will, how can this benefit them or will it like interfere, mix, 
um, destroy something with other medicine they're using because of the way the zeolite like travel around or anything you, you like know, that? I tell people that if you're under a physician's care on a prescription drug, make sure you've read for contraindications on those drugs, or if you're concerned, make sure you talk to your physician. The zeolite doesn't have a contraindication. So there's no reason for us to believe based on past history that it would interfere with medication or certain foods or certain lifestyles. But I always encourage people to make themselves aware. So for example, if you were on a drug I can't think of any that fit in this category, but it said, don't use a mineral supplement. Well, then you wouldn't use the zeolite at the same time you're taking it. But I don't know of any like that, but I just tell people, pay attention, read the warnings or the contraindications, but I'm unaware of any of those challenges for the zeolite. So <clears throat> contraindication, what, what is that actually? Contraindication means that you shouldn't use it while doing something else. Okay. And so there, there, you know, like for example, this is real simple, but let's say you were taking a narcotic, it would probably have a warning that said, don't drive a vehicle, right? So that's a contraindication. Okay. And so it's basically an attached, recognized by public or regulator, a, a warning and zeolites don't come with those. Mm. Uh, there's just not anything issued out there. That is very good to know. Very good to know. Um, I had yeah, um, and and being a being a former athlete, I just want to add to in my opinion and as I understand it, I mean, zeolite has nothing to do with doping. I mean, any athlete can do this because it it it's not absorbed by the body, right? Yeah, there there would be no reason to think that that would have any impact on uh, drug testing. It's it's inert. Mm -hmm. And so it's not creating a stimulation in the body. It's inert in its action. Passive. Passive be another way to say it. Yeah, right. Um, because that's really a caution when you're an athlete. It's like, yeah. oh my God. It's, uh... Uh, another question um, is, um, what was that? That was, um, um, yeah. Does the zeolite in any way alkalize? the body. Ah. It, it does, right? Because it's going to bind with excess hydrogen molecules that have a positive charge in the gut. So it's an indirect benefit is it supports how the body alkalizes. And in the same way we talked about before, where if you lower the burden of heavy metals in the body, the immune system works better if you lower the burden of heavy metals in the body, it's also easier for the body to alkalize and reverse the acidic culture that a lot of people create in their body through diet and habits. And so it's uh, it's going to support the body trying to find that homeostasis yeah. uh, of alkalinity. Mm. Because that's, as we know, has a lot to do with a healthy body. Sure does. Yes. Yeah. How your immune function, central nervous system, all those things. Mm. Yeah being alkaline and and then another thing came to mind is like parasites they are a part of many people's bodies and they they can do a lot of harm right with with uh, draining you of energy uh they're actually feeding on the food that you eat and 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 there's many ways you don't you you just don't get the energy you want and as i understand removing the toxicity and the heavy metals from the body the parasites get less to eat and they have a problem, right? Yeah, that's right. So with parasites, it's not just the nutrition that they're stealing, but it's also the oxygen from the blood. Yeah. And so people don't realize where their exhaustion is, is, is coming from. What you want to do, uh, because parasites can really be a challenge, is try to make yourself as, as uh, bad a host as possible. Yeah. And so the more alkaline your body is, the, the proper way to say it is you become an inhospitable host. And so the, zeal, the, the, the parasites are going to want to evacuate or leave, right? They're no longer in an environment they're comfortable with and or because of detoxification and, and becoming more alkaline, the, zeal, the parasite becomes visible to your immune system. So parasites partially survive because they create a membrane structure that hides them from your immune system. Mm. 
And so if you strip away those barriers, if you make yourself an inhospitable host, the parasites don't want to be there. And they're very likely to evacuate uh, uh, via your bowels. Hmm. Good. We want to get that sh shit out of the body. So let's Absolutely. clean one and running on clean fuel. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, Eddie, I, I do love to, to use both of these. And could you give us a brief, brief thing into how, how, why they, why both of them are good to take, to take, they complement each other. The bottle with the green label, we refer mm -hmm. to it as pure body or pure body regular, and its molecule structure is bigger than that in the blue bottle. You can see it. You can taste it. You can even feel it in your mouth. Even though it may be in water, you can kind of tell there's something mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. The blue bottle, the Pure Body Extra, you can't tell it's there. It's so small. The green one is designed and it's sized the way it is so that it mostly stays in the gut. And so it is primarily for detoxification in the gut and helping to support a good, healthy human biome, which is basically the good microorganisms that are found in your gut and your bowel. Which the is blue, a huge part of our immune system. It's like the body's pharmacy. Yes. Yeah, that's where it comes from. So, mm -hmm. and then the other, the blue label, the nano size is for your cell structure. So they are used at the same time. They work synergistically. I know for myself, even though I've been doing this for 10 years with, with, with my touchstone baby, um, I use them both because I think they're both important. I, I travel quite a bit. I find myself on airplanes. I meet a lot of different people and, you know, people bring germs and pollutants with them, right? And so do planes. And so I think it's just part of trying to maintain good health by using a steady amount of both the green label and the blue label. Yeah, thank you. Okay, so um, anything to add? Let's summarize um, the great reasons for using the zeolite. And as I say, my heart, I, I can so uh, recommend these for the how clean they are, because you really clean the cellulite, makes it stronger uh, to, to really attract a lot, and then carry it out the door, <laughs> peeing yeah. it out, so to say. Um, yeah, summarizing. Well, here's, here's what we know, right? The world we live in is toxic. And it doesn't matter if you live in a pristine country like Norway or a busy metropolis in London, right? It's just, it's just a part of everyday living in a modern world is toxins. On top of that, it's a go-go world, right? People eat on the go. They eat a lot of ultra-processed foods. And so in today's world, I don't know that we take enough time with both our food, our exercise, and our lifestyle. And so we believe, just given the toxic burden the risk you have for developing degenerative diseases when you have excess amount of toxins, mm -hmm. that it's important to add this as part of your health routine. Mm -hmm. Just like you pay attention to micronutrients in a good diet or sleeping well or exercising, we believe products that support detoxification, support how your body detoxifies, green leafy vegetables, cruciferous vegetables, and zeolite are critical uh, for good health. And that's a message we find resonates around the globe and, and people see real personal benefits uh, over time as they detoxify. And I want to add, it is so easy to use. Wow. Instead of all the juicing and, and all these other protocols for doing stuff, this is so easy to use. It's like 30 seconds, three times a day, and, and you're there. Yeah. Uh, and that, that, that's okay, too, in, in a busy life that many people have. Yeah. So um, you want to share about this amazing offer that yeah, I, you, I, I you want to give my audience? Yeah, I, I do, because I, I really appreciate that you're helping to pioneer this messaging in Norway and, and make sure people are aware of toxins and, and the impacts to their health. And so we want to support you. And so for people that don't know us, uh, or they want to try us for the first time or try these products for the first time, we're giving you what essentially is a $50 off coupon. 
And so this product normally sells for $79.95. And so you're going to be able to give it to your subscribers through the link at $50 off the retail, or if they want to go on our subscription service, which is $63.83, $50 off of that. So they can get it for under, <coughs> excuse me, $15 uh, USD. And we think that makes it affordable to try it. Mm -hmm. And of course, we believe they'll have a good experience and want to continue to use it. And if they get it on the subscription, it's the it's the least expensive way to use it. But we believe every every ounce of it is is worth it in terms of supporting your good health. Yeah. So the there will be a link. This is like a month um, supply, and um, the link will be below. And uh, enter in there, and uh, you will go for the auto auto subscription, and you can anytime opt out of that one. Oh, yeah. 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 And either you do it by logging in yourself, or it's this amazing support that you have. They are so loving and helpful. So they will help you if you just contact them. So yeah. it's no obligations here, but it's amazing to try. And personally, I would recommend that that uh, people try like for, you try for like three to six months actually, uh, and because there is cleaning, a cleaning, a cleaning, a cleaning going on. And so for many people, it's like, um, it's actually a bit like exercising. You're never actually very strong <laughs> the next day. No, but, that's know, right. It takes time. It takes time and, and it actually builds up. And, and uh, so to have, the, to have the benefits. So be, be patient with yourself and your body and allow yourself to, to, to take some time with this. That is my, my advice on that. It's good advice. Yeah. And so, well, yeah, thanks for that, uh, for, for, for giving my audience this offer. Um, Eddie, Happy to do it. So, yeah. And thank you for the chance to be on your broadcast. Thank you, and it's an honor having you here. And so um, remember, dear audience, that you and your health is one. There's no separation in here. You are one on this. And there is nothing more important than your health. Everyone, we all have something we struggle with, but we, what we can do is do our best to, to minimize the problems and to help our body back to a better immune system to more strength. Uh, and there are luckily many ways doing it. And this zeolite is nature's wonder, one of nature's beautiful wonders, I would say. And, and Eddie, uh, the way you and your company um, provide this and the way you produce this and provide this is totally amazing. Adding, I, I, I like other of your products too. It's, it's, uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a fan. <laughs> thank you very much. Okay, so Eddie, thank you very much for joining in this conversation and everything you have shared, uh, the knowledge you have. And um, so, Touchstone Essentials and the Zeolite. Thank you very audience. much. Thank, thank you. you. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.